All right, lovely. So here's my outfit of the day. I just have on this subdued lavender dress from Miss Guided. And then I have on these mules from Miss Guided. They're kind of inspired by the Lido Muse from Bottega. It's just a bodycon maxi dress. It's made of knit. I'll show you a up close of the material but it's very comfortable it's very thick so that's the outfit hi lovelies it's erica with the beauty buff and welcome back to my channel if you enjoy a channel full of beauty fashion and lifestyle then please subscribe below hit the notification bell so you won't miss any of my future uploads comment down below and let me know if you enjoyed the video and then don't forget to give this video a thumbs up as well on today, I'm gonna to be sharing with you a haul. Yes, it's another haul. My favorite types of videos. I love to shop. Fortunately, I'm kind of shopaholic. Um, this one is not as bad. It's a haul from Misguided. I just picked up a few items that I saw on the site that I was loving and I had to get them and of course I had to share them with you. So I'm just gonna be going over those um, items that I purchased on Misguided. I hope you enjoy the video. Remember, on this channel, we just like to relax and let loose, get away from the everyday grind. Um, it's a lot going on in the world. We're still out there working. I know you have the kids in school. Some of you are homeschooling. So it's just a lot going on all around. So this video, I just want you to relax, get you soda, a cup of wine, some water. Just calm down, relax, put your feet up, calm down from your day. So if you will with me, take in a good deep breath, exhale, and let's get to this video. lovely so the first item that I'm going to show you is what I have on this is just a lilac kind of subdued lavender midi dress you would have saw it in the outfit of the day video and I paid $17 for it the shoes that I also will be showing you a clip of I paid $28 for those so I really think it's worth it the material is very thick it is a midi dress. You can wear this in the fall, put you um, a scarf, a coat over it. You can always put like a long sleeve turtleneck up under it, put you some boots on, um, some stockings, your legs will be warm. So you can also wear this outfit in the spring and in the fall and carry it over into the winter. It's up to you how you wear it. You can dress it up, dress it down. You can put on some nice low mules, close toe if you would like. You can put some heels on however you want um, but I think it's really simple and then you just dress it up with your accessories so I really like it I like the color on my skin tone I just think it's a cute outfit all around the shoes are very comfortable they are stylish I do like the mule type shoe so those are the little mules in the middle is the Gianni Bieni and then you have misguided so you can see the misguided has the more of the square toe like the Lido so if you enjoy this outfit, then pick it up because I think it's really cute. So the second accessory I'm going to show you is this lovely Bottega inspired bag. This is a black bag. It has a gold top handle and also a gold strap that you can wear cross body. It's weaving detail both in the front and the back. And then also when you open it up, it has that weaving detail here in the front. It's just like one open pouch in there with a pocket on the side. It's big enough to hold your cell phone, some makeup, a wallet if you would like. Um, but I think this is really good quality. It's a very nice purse. It's made very well. I really like the design of it. I like the fact that it has a top handle. You can take this crossbody chain off. I think the crossbody chain is very versatile you can take this off of here and wear this as a belt if you want or put it on another purse it's very weighty 
I'll show you an up close video of it, but it's just really nice. And I was surprised to see this cross body chain on the inside. As soon as I saw it, I was like, wow, you could just do so much with this chain itself. So I really do enjoy this bag. And the purse is called Black Weave Detail Cross Body Bag, and I paid $26. So that's very good. For $26, this is really good quality. The next item I picked up at Misguided is this faux leather, light blue, long sleeve button up shirt. It's very weighty. It's lined on the inside. It buttons up, it has a collar. It has like pleated puff sleeves. It has a button down here at the cuff. It does have a belt around the waist. It's very good quality, very weighted material. It's not like that really thin faux leather. It does have pockets, and they actually are pockets. You can open them up and put something in there. And so I'm gonna try everything on, so it should be like a side-by-side -side view, or some view in this video of me trying this on. But this is a very big color for the season, this blue. A lot of people been wearing it with the other really hot color of the season which is chocolate or dark brown so you can get you like a dark brown knit to go up under this you can wear these with some dark brown slacks it's just so much like you can do with this so I do like the pleats on the shirting and the way that the belt centers your waist in being that the shirt is kind of more bulky and baggy you do have that option to like make the belt really tight and make your waist more cinched which I like so that was called a Blue Core Fox Leather Oversized Belted Shirt and it was $39. Along with that shirt, I did buy the matching biker shorts. They are faux leather. They have a zip on the side here and they also have this little tab on the side. The shorts I did purchase in a 14 because they did not have my size in a 12. So they are a little bit more baggy than I would like. Um, the waist is have a lot of room in the waist, a lot of room down here in the legs. I still like the fit, but I know I would have preferred the fit of my 12 rather than the 14. But I don't think it looks bad. But they are very good quality too. They're kind of weighty. They don't have the lining inside, but they have like this cotton polyester material on the inside. So with these, you could wear like tights up under them. You can get you like a nice chocolate turtleneck or a nice chocolate sweater to wear with these and some over the knee chocolate boots. And then I have like this trench coat, this suede trench coat, I'm gonna get it. So I have like this, I think it's polyester. I got this from TJ Maxx. So it's like a polyester spandex type material, but this and these shorts with some tights, a nice chocolate sweater, some over the knee boots, I think that would be so cute. And this is like a Florida coat, it's not extremely thick, it's kind of, you know, on the thinner side. So being that I do live in Florida, this is a coat that I can actually get some wear out of, but I got this, like I said, like last year at TJ Maxx, I haven't worn it yet. But I have quite a few coats like this, I have like a red one and a hunter green but this material for Florida is really good because it's not extremely heavy. And even though it's like the trench style, I can still wear it here in the fall or the winter and I won't be too hot. But sorry, I know I got off track. I was talking about these shorts, but I just think like with the chocolate theme and the blue, these shorts would be so good with like a chocolate sweater or a chocolate long sleeve shirt and some tights over the knee boots, you know, however you wanna dress it up. But I also bought it to pair with the actual shirt itself. So I thought that would have been cute. So I thought this would be cute together. The next piece that I purchased from Misguided is this white sweatshirt. It has like the exaggerated shoulder here, like the Isabelle Marant style, but it's in the sweatshirt material. And then it also has this drawstring at the bottom so you can pull it in and make it um, tighter. Or if you want to make it cropped, you can do that with this little drawstring. But I thought this was extremely cute. You can wear this with some jeans. You can even wear it with like those biker shorts if you want to. But very cute sweatshirt. But a very unique take on the sweatshirt. So I thought this was really cute. 
I just like the shoulder padding on here, the wide shoulders or exaggerated shoulders. And then you have the little drawstring here where you can crop it if you like. The next piece that I purchased was these peach faux leather pants. They do have drawstrings in the waist and then at the bottom they're cuffed. So you can either you can also wear that sweatshirt that I just showed with these peach pants as well. But I thought these was I thought these were really cute. And then it's very soft, very like flexible, not stiff. So I think that's really cute. And I forgot to tell you what I paid for the sweatshirt. The white sweatshirt was $23. And these pants were the peach faux leather turn up joggers. They're $30. Not bad for the price at all. So the next item I purchased is this dress. It's called a Black Star Print Shoulder Pad Midi Dress. And it was $33. And it has the shoulder pad detailing here. It's long sleeves. It has little stars everywhere. It's ruffled at the bottom. It does zip here in the back. And it's just another take on that Isabel Marant style. I thought I could wear these with the combat boots that I purchased. Or you can wear them with like some sleek pair of high heel boots and I'll show you those also. But I thought this was a really cute dress. So the next item I purchased is this shirt. It's just a sage corset seam high neck top and it was $17. So it says it's in the sage color. It looks kind of like a light yellow or a light lime green, but they said sage, so. But I just like the detailing here. I like that it had the like semi high neck with the seams here in the front. And then it was long sleeves here. So you can wear this up under a blazer. You can wear it up under a cardigan. You can wear it along with some jeans however you feel like styling it. I did purchase a few pair of jeans, so I'll just try my jeans on with this shirt, so. It has the little seams here on the shirt. It's high neck, it has the ruffles on the sleeve. So I just think that's really cute. It is kind of thin. You can kind of see my black bra through it, but I think it's very, it's a very cute shirt. The next item I purchased are these jeans. Of course, every fall winter I have to stock up on some more jeans. I am a jean girl in the winter. I love them. And these jeans were, these jeans are the Blue Center High Waisted Ripped Skinny Denim and they were $26. So they just have the distressing here at the knee and on this side at the knee. And then the back just has pockets. They are high waisted and then they slim down at the bottom there. So this is the other pair of jeans that I purchased, the high waisted. I just threw on my Gucci news with these and it's the same blouse that I had on the last time. I do prefer the fit of these jeans. These are more skinny than the mom jeans. I like that it's high waisted. Skinny jean, I am more willing to wear a flat width. I think it does look better because it's tapered down towards the ankle and it's not flared. And then the last item that I purchased was a pair of jeans as well. And they're the Blue, the Blue Stone Wash Riot High Rise Rip Denim Mom Jeans and they were $30. And this is how it looks. So they're distressed at the knee and at the thigh. So just have some ribs here. And also on this side. And then the back just has pockets. There are, you know, mom jeans are a little looser fit. And then you have the bottom that are distressed as well. All right, lovely. So that's all the items that I purchased from Misguided. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of my future uploads. And thank you so much for spending a part of your day with me. And I hope to see you in my next video.